Hello everyone, we are going to look for Raffaello, uh, that baby that fell out of the sky in an egg and hatched and could instantly speak for some reason. Coupeau! So Trife, what are you going to do with your day off? It's an old rusted steam engine. You can see the remains of a railroad track. Where does it go? Good question. There's a letter under the locomotive. We see mystery letter 4. Okay, let's... My name is Zeke, and I am the knight who defends Memoria. Hark, brave warrior, find your my memories, and their power will be yours. Then speak to the Moogle who collects beautiful words and tell him this. Camelot. There is great power in words. Alright. So we gotta look for things. That's... And stuff. We're just gonna skip through her dialogue. Oh, that's not it. Came lot. Battle trumpet. Why is there a letter underneath the rusty steam that was written by a knight of Memoria? That is the best question, Doge. Juba. The number of romantic phrases in your possession is now four. I hereby certify you as rookie romantic. Bye now, rookie romantic. So far, Gilgamesh is the best one I found, I think. Well, that in Bahamut. Slice thrice. I don't know what these pop-up battles are, but I'll figure it out eventually. I'm sure they'll explain them to me at some point. Alright, where to? Examine the well? No. Alright. The windmill. Oh, the kid's probably in town because that's where the marker is leading me to. We're in the land of Memoria, Juba. Which I thought you might appreciate given that you're a big fan of FF9. Your water gurgles from the pen. Yes. Oh, there's a little joke about. That was completely worth it. I'm glad I did that. Wouldn't let me get it. Hmm. 
Oh, it's amazing, amazing. The baby flew in the sky. I see it with my own eyes. That baby, he is called Raffaello, da? He went rush into the air and then flew to the mining zone. Yes, yes, to the northeast of town. You selling things for me yet? Come in, come in, get your fish here, except there's a problem. I can't use the engine on my boat without the fire. That means I can't go out to fish. Oh, I need fresh fish. Okay, hang on a sec. Let's go back here and see if maybe I can pick up that bucket and lure. That statue seems incredibly detailed. I never even bothered to look at the statue. Hang on. So it does. That's why they got it turned away from the camera. Hey, let me have them. Yeah, I want them. Fine, fuck you. Don't let me have them then. I see how it is. Yeah, I'll watch it later on when I look at the recording. I was busy looking at the little chocobo. I can't mix medicine with a fire now, can I? What if I made a mistake? You fuckers never sell anything in this town. Always an excuse. Oh, you're a chocobo, aren't you? And how is young Raffaello? What's wrong? Has something happened to Raffaello? Well, I can't understand a word you're saying, trying to say. Why don't you calm down and look at some nice flowers instead? They mentioned her shop like it was relevant, but it is not. I'll get Raffaello? Ah, the green-haired baby, eh? Yes, I heard about him. I also said he flew to see us in the mining zone, but how did he do that? He has no wings. Maybe Al is telling a little fib, eh? Well, I want the right equipment. It just won't let me pick up the right equipment. I've been praying all night, but we still have daughter Fi Fi back here. Yeah? Fine, don't let me do the church. I see how it is. What are you doing? Have you met Freya yet? She lives over in the mining zone. She's bright and cheerful, and oh, what an appetite that girl has, but she hasn't been herself recently. I wonder why. You're only young once, is what I always say. You have to enjoy it while you can. Guess we're going in here. I have Gil. Gizzle Green's not a supportive currency, apparently. Remember, the monsters dropped Gil. Why is this plant alive? Why would you keep this in your building? That's no chew, I think. What, Raphael? Oh, you mean that strange baby boy? I heard rumors about him floating in the air and try flying towards the mines. I don't know that, but isn't that too strange? Flew through the sky before. What the fuck is that surprising? I have no business without fire. I had to add salt water to the menu, but then all my knives and pots and pans started rusting away. Oh, what am I gonna do if I go out of business? Priest did not take it from me. I admit that forgetting my own name was an issue, but I still stand by my mission that forgetting is the first step to, in achieving happiness. Bad memories lead to hatred, and hatred leads to conflicts. We can have peace if we just f forget, and conflicts lead to the dark side. What are you? You're so cute, you're a chocobo! I'm Claire! The only chocobos I've seen were the fat chocobos at the storage! I've never seen one so yellow and fluffy like you! 
I'm Ronnie. I don't have a mom or dad, so I'm all alone. But I don't feel lonely. Because whenever I feel lonely, I hear the clock tower bell strike and then I forget everything. Alright. Okay, Chips Adventuring Rule number two! The brave know when to run. Rookie adventurers always get too greedy and take too many chances. Maybe that works for a while, but no one's lucky forever. If you're beaten in battle, you'll lose all your gill and items, except what you're wearing. Greed will cost you. So take it slowly, bit by bit. And if things are getting spooky, hightail it out of there. Lick these split and live to fight another day. Paint the chocobo? I don't think I can. Harry's Hardware. What do you got for me? Hello, Hello mate. Hello, mate. Welcome to Harry's Hardware. Here to shop, are you? Feel free to look around all you want. Hmm. Gistle Greens are 150. Okay, so I don't want to buy any of this. It's really expensive. Probably sell some of those rusty saddles I have, though. Oof! My name's Ran. I patrol the mine in that zone. I know everything that goes on here. Okay. Good for you. Going to the mall, I guess. What's in here? White pack. Yeah, I don't know if uh, spray painting the uh, chocobo is a thing in this. with the Moogles in this the town. conceals his true identity, but he unmasks the evil of this world. Have no fear. The roving hero pop up here loves this year. Hoop -hoop. I haven't played Final Fantasy Life. I kind of want to, though. I hear it's really long, though. Yeah, Fantasy Life, I know. I, uh, I've been meaning to play it, I just haven't got around to it. Pop-up duels. Okay, so this is what uh, Messenger was talking about. You're gonna explain these to me? No? Alright. Let's check it out. You can play the minigame pop up duel. Hold the Wii remote upright. Your game will automatically be saved. Okay. Pop up duels are also totally useless and add nothing to the game. Well, that's minigames for you. Usually that's the case. Enter a name. Okay, so I gotta hold it like this. the tutorial. In a pop-up duel, you summon monsters to battle for you, Koopa. 
To fight a duel, you need a collection of duel cards. Select your favorites and assemble them into a deck, Koopa. The duel starts with three cards that are pulled out of your deck at random. These cards form a hand, Koopa. When the three cards in your hands appear on the screen, the pop-up phase begins, Koopa. Press right, up, or left to select a card, then hold B and swing the Wii Remote. This will pop up a card and summon its monster. The monster will then fight your opponent's beast, Koopa. Remember, the advantage goes to the monster who attacks first, Koopa. So pop up your card faster than your opponent and strike early and take control of the duo. When both duists have popped up their cards, the monster will attack. This is called a turn, Koopa. The first monster has a turn, then the second monster takes a turn, Koopa. When both monsters have finished their attacks, you go back to the pop-up phase, Koopa. The duel continues until someone's health reaches zero. Then it's duel over, Koopa. Oops, okay. When your attack or guard break is successful, your monster attacks, Koopa. Look, look carefully to see what abilities your monster has, Koopa. Some abilities deliver extra damage, some will heal you. There are all kinds of abilities. Now it's time to learn about guarding, Koopa. If you block your opponent's attack, his, all, all his abilities will be neutralized, Koopa. Not only that, if you have abilities on your card, they'll be used against the opponent. Now I have some very important advice for you, Koopa. Some abilities can, you, can cause afflictions. When you hit an opponent with an affliction, the icon appears next to his health gauge. Afflictions like burn, poison, freeze, or numb will last until the end of the next turn, so watch out. Keep an eye on your health gauge, and when things get dangerous, think about trying to guard against attacks, Koopa. Yeah, sure, alright. Sure. Pop up here. So you want to know about cards, Koopa? Let's look at magic circles each card has. Four magic circles at the top, bottom, left, and right. Circles might contain a sword, or shield, or a spear. Learn them, Koopa, because they're key to dueling. When you make an attack, the circles on your monster's card are compared to the circles on the opponent's card, Koopa. This is called matching. It determines if your attack is successful or not. But we'll learn about that later. There are three types of dueling cards, Koopa. Attack, guard, and guard break. Attack cards have the sword ability card mark, Koopa. Guard cards have the ability... Shield ability, Koopa. Guard break cards have the spear ability mark, Koopa. If you want to get good at dueling, you have to learn about abilities and their effects, Koopa. There are lots of different kinds of abilities. Some deal damage, some heal, and some cast spells on the foe, Koopa. You should collect as many cards as you can and see what abilities they have and learn which ones work best. Pop up Hero X. It's time to learn about matching. This is a super important lesson, Koopa. First, let's have a look at an attack card, Koopa. Compare the magic circle with the sword mark for attacking. Do the same circle with the opponent's card. If the opponent's circle is empty, then your attack is successful, Koopa. Your attack will hit the enemy monster. If the opponent's circle has a spear mark, guard break, then the attack will is successful, Koopa. Your attack will hit. If the opponent's circle has a sword mark, attack, the attack is successful. But ability effects are halved, Koopa. If the opponent's circle has a shield mark, the attack fails, your opponent blocks the attack, Koopa. Next look at the guard break. Print to the magic circle with the spear mark. But guard break to the same circle. Alright, so it's failed unless it's a shield. It has a spear mark, the guard break will fail, and your abilities will not work, Koopa. The opponent's circle has a sword mark, attack. Oops. Finally, let's look at the guard type. Guard type cards don't have a sword or shield, uh, sword or spear marks that can. So there's no matching the card types uh, compared. It all depends on what the opponent does, Koopa. That's how matching works. Yeah, okay. When both monsters have finished their turn, you enter the end phase. It occurs just before you go back to start a new uh, pop-up phase. In the end phase, the card you place turns into a crystal. The crystals will be the same color as your card, Koopa. The monster cards summon non-elemental monsters, but they're super strong. Great monster cards. But they don't turn into crystals. Now, crystals are counted with crystal points, Koopa. So crystal points are very valuable because you use them to unleash ultra-powerful crystal abilities, Koopa. Okay. Let's sum it all up so you can become a super duelist like me. Here are Mog's three rules for successful dueling, Koopa. One, try to predict what card your opponent will play, Koopa. If you can guess what kind of card your opponent will play, you can win in the matching phase of the turn, Koopa. Ma watch the color card colors in your opponent's hand during the pop-up phase to plan your attack, Koopa. Two, use your head when you build your deck, Koopa. Even if you protect your opponent's moves perfectly, if your cards are too weak, then what's the point, Koopa? If all your cards are the same color, you'll soon get in big trouble, Koopa. 
Use your imagination and wits, Koopa. Think about your strategy and build a winning deck. Three, collect lots and lots of cards, Koopa. If you want to build a powerful deck, you'll need cards to choose from, and lots of them, Koopa. Here's a hint. Some people say you can find cards even outside the dungeons, Koopa. Okay. Lesson time is over, Koopa. Keep practicing, and one day you might be a pop-up hero just like Mog, Koopa. Alright, so I don't... I'm not overly excited about this. I'm terrible at card games. I just put effort in, I guess. Deal two damage. Cards are red. Turtle power. All right, that's a defensive card, I guess. Put a green attack in there. I don't have very many cards, so. Miss Dragon. Bismarck. That's a good one. Let's try that. Oh, I gotta throw Carbuncle in there. That has to happen. Let's go lose a card game. Well, we can only do training, so... Sure. Ah, Final Fantasy 1 music! No, it's Final Fantasy 2 music, my bad. I just had the opening sound. All right, let's see here. Let's start off with... Ramu. Let's do this. I guarded. You're a shit. Alright. Let's try Shiva. Oh, he blocks blue. That's not fun. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Computer's way better at this than I am. I'm awful at this. Okay, that wasn't good. Thank you. 
Ah, half damage. Oh, I did one damage on the best, and he's burning. Ha <laughs> ha! On fire. What is this card game? This is... Interesting. Oh, he blocks fire! Fuck you, game! You had to foresee my strategy. Reverse Thun's next patch. I hate you so much, Dragon. Alright. Alright, Cactuar, let's do it. Lunk. Yeah, I did three damage. I'm gonna take three damage though. Ouch. Getting slammed by a giant sword. Okay, let's see here. Alright, Kate Sith. Near Automata is amazing? I believe you. Lamia considers the situation. Alright, we're closing the gap. We're doing good here. Alright, let's try to turtle up here. What do we got? Adamantoys, let's do this. Watch him use a card breaker. Nope, haha, <laughs> fuck you. Adamantoys considers the situation. Moogle megaphones. And it is blocked, fuck you. Alright. Unicorn Rush! Aw, oh, damn it, he blocks. So rude. But I do block damage, so is that. He gets numbed. I lost two CP. It's unfortunate. Out right now. Carbuncle, we can do this. Block the attack, buddy. Uh, unfortunately, Carbuncle is not going to block this attack. I lose! Sussy Sissy's going to do six damage to me here. <laughs>
yeah, I probably won't be uh, uh, dropping the, the games I plan to play, but... But I'm glad you found a game that you enjoy. So, how'd you like the pop-up duel? Good ball. That was pretty cool. Keep collecting cards and study the card deck carefully, Koopa. There's more to the pop-up duel than meets the eye, Koopa. You can obtain cards by defeating enemies in dungeons or by clearing certain events, Koopa. So collect lots of cards and build your own ultimate deck, Koopa. But that's not all, Koopa. I've got two other mini games here, Koopa. A high score might earn you a card, Koopa. Go! There's actually one more. But you have to clear the game to find out what. Koopa! Interesting. Okay, Winjig. Yeah, um... I have no doubt that Nier Automata is awesome and it's worth, uh... It, it may even be better than Final Fantasy XV, in my opinion, too. But I really enjoyed Final Fantasy XV. And yeah, I'm playing Zelda as well. Um... Trife, I'm up to 80-something Korok seeds now. Still haven't found the dude. Oh, so you're Chocobo. You're the talk of the town. And so cute. But my, what big talons you have. I can take those talons and... Uh... Sharma? What's the matter? We don't usually see you in town. Raffaello! Raffaello's missing! That's the baby that fell out of the sky, right? Everyone's talking about him. They say you can remember things when that baby's around. I wish I could remember a few things. It's a little boring not having any memories, you know? Hmm? Wait. Something's coming back. I was fighting. But with who? And what for? I'll find him eventually. Now you'll never remember. Um, what was I talking about? No, oh, never mind. If I forgot about it, it probably wasn't that important. Well, see you, Sherma. Okay, time to get cracking. Huh. What was I going to get cracking on? I'm forgetting too many things these days. Oh well. I guess this means I should just take the rest of the day off. I feel like this would be pretty inconvenient. Yeah, that's fine, silly. Yeah, it's gotta be him. I'm gonna hop inside this dungeon here, and then uh, I'll do the first floor, and then hop out. I haven't unlocked jobs yet. When do I unlock those? Because, uh, yeah, I gotta be done the stream here in a few moments. But, uh, I'll be back tomorrow. But we're gonna do this floor first. Oh, yeah, I'm level 5. Is this the slums music from 7? No, this is 8. This is, uh, like the music that plays when you're in, um, Galvedia Garden and such. Have no fear! Dungeon Hero X is here! Sorry to keep you waiting, Koopa. You sing good, Chocobo! I'm here to give you advice, Koopa! If an item has a strange or vague name, it's a mystery item, Koopa! You can use it anyway, or bring it out with you. But it could be cursed or have negative effects, Koopa. So use appraisal glasses to find out what it is before using it, Koopa. I 
hope you found my advice helpful, Koopa. That's it for now, Koopa. Farewell! Ah, uh, yes, uh, Chunlock. Didn't take you long to notice that at all. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna just do the first floor and then leave. Alright, what do we got here? Potion! Oh. Critical hit to the ghost. Job points. All right, cool. What do we got here? Abilities. Uh, no, not abilities. Status. 46 job points to level. 246 exp to level. If I can do some leveling off stream, I'll probably will to make this go a little quicker. Time for some chocobo kick. Oh, it's not that bad. You don't critically hit me. 14 XP, not bad. Shit, I didn't mean to step on that. Damn it. Yeah, so we're gonna flee the dungeon. Do I lose my EXP when I leave a dungeon? If I don't, that'll make leveling easy as I'll just stay on this floor. <laughs> I still have need the same EXP and jobs, so there we go. Alright everyone, so for tomorrow we'll be coming back to more Final Fantasy Fables, uh, Chocobo's Dungeon. But I had a lot of fun getting into this today, I hope that you guys did too. If you want to see the playthrough or anything you missed in this or previous games, check out my YouTube. Uh, my Twitter will let you know when I'm going live. Uh, usually it's around this time. Tomorrow I'll be starting a little early as I have work meetings on... Uh, on t Tuesdays but thank you very much for viewing everyone if you uh, want to see more of the game please give me a follow uh, I'll be back quite often with this and other games like Final Fantasy Explorers Final Fantasy 14 Final Fantasy 11 well right now it seems to be mostly Final Fantasy have a good one guys see you later